Shogun's cutting a promo next to me. Nobody can hear it. It's good, though. It's good. It's Eight good men in this ring, all of them vied for a shot at Shogun Machete's heavyweight title. We have all eight in the ring. I, I've never, I, I didn't even know the ring could hold all these competitors. We got a lot of meat in there. Yeah, I agree. This is, this, you know, this, this reminds me of a bunkhouse brawl, man. A lot of, a lot of egos in this match. Too. Oh. That was ring. <laughs> Shogun Machete wanted to, uh, has requested me to let you viewers at home know that he's beaten a third of the competitors that are in the ring. What's a third of eight, though? Uh, two and two thirds. Gotcha. Yes. So I don't know who he beat for a two count, but... Oh, Rex Taylor is getting oh, walked over! Yes, it is. Rex Taylor already on the outside. And Kent! Kent Cassidy's the one that got him into this match, and he turned his back on him. Rex has no friends. Nobody has any friends. These guys are just a bit... Uh-oh. Wait a minute. I think Kent's the wrong place for wrong time. I think he should have... Uh, oh. Wishes he had eyes in the back of his head now. He's probably wishing... He's probably wishing Keita Burton would help him out. And Rex isn't going... In, is not in any hurry to help him either. No. Nope. Both of them are out. And he throws it back oh, in. Rex throws it back in. Here we go. Oh, and they are lighting the kid up. Kid in for a third time. Oh, Cyrus Mars back kick dumped him. Every man for himself tonight, except for uh, I guess his gang up on Kid Cassidy night. Now the now the man Moran. Here we go. What is going Throws on? Throws to the outside. Kid, do, Kid doesn't even know where he's at right. Oh, and he just throws right it to, to the, the that the knee. Kid. Uh-oh. Tyrone Kidd's pointing to the foreman. And the hunter. What do they have in mind, Brad? Uh-oh. Oh, the mom sandwich. Unbelievable. How is he still standing? <laughs> Cassidy is D-E-D -E -D dead. I think he's better off just rolling under the ring and, wait and just, just hanging out there. What is Cyrus doing? I think Cyrus is trying to negotiate with the, the Ministry of Mad Manliness. They weren't having anything to do with it. And the, and the Cougar, oh, and they're doing his little hand sign, his little taunt thing. Mark Skyros. That's up on the D pad for Cyrus Mars. Yes. Now we got some. Uh, this is just nonsense. What is happening right now? Mark Skyros lost that game. I don't think any of these men realize the opportunity that they have in front of them. Uh oh, what's going on? Oh, God! You know, right, there's stuff going on everywhere, folks. I know the camera can't see everything. No. To our right, Mike Skyros is being, is whooping Kit Cassidy. Johnny Moran is beating on Rex Taylor. Cyrus Mars is crying. I need another set of eyes. I need another cameraman out here. I'll tell you what, the two smartest men in this, you know, and they don't, they don't look like SAT takers, but the two smartest men in this match are the Ministry of Manliness. Yeah, you're well, right. Wait a minute, I spoke too soon. Now these two goofballs are on the outside. Wait a minute, they're, they're just dogs. eating! They're eating! They're just taking, they're just going for some, they're taking a food break. Cyrus Mars is the only man that's, they're smart right, right now. upset that they're eating. Wait a minute, Tucker Riley is, is having a hot dog. Can I get a hot dog? They're just eating a hot dog in here. Milk. We're sitting here in the middle of that. Backbreakers. Now Tyrone Riley having a hot dog. Look at Riley having a hot dog. Absolute chaos it is, it going on here in back podium in the ring. Tyrone Kidd. <laughs> we have Tyrone Kidd. He's got Cyrus Mars up. He's just holding him for this. Oh, big Tucker. suplex. Tucker, can I get a hot, give me a hot, give me a hot dog. Give me a hot dog. My partner's preoccupied with the hot dog, the I'm energy, sorry, the I'm insanity sorry. that's going on here. Tyrone I'll the dead. action in the ring. Rex Taylor just right throws right. Tyrone Kidd, the student of the game, right out of the ring. What is the ladder's there just right. sitting on the bottom rope. Somebody should grab Rex that ladder and go in. Rex doesn't win this match, 
right there. Our man's coming back in. He's got his hot dog. He's all, they have the hot dog, the Chinese buffet. They have all the energy right now. This is, wait a minute. Now we got the, th the two, three biggest men in this match in the ring right now. Foreman really taking it to Rex. Shoots him off. Ron Wilder turned out to a big boot. Now wait a minute, you forgot about Skyros. He's got the most energy. He, he wrestled was the first. first one tonight, you're right. They're dropping him a corner. It right now. Ron Wilder still he, trying to digest that first hot dog. You can see them right now, the Ministry of Manliness, they're, they're oh, second win. God. They had a tough encounter before with Big Aaron Nasty and Jacoby Riddick. And now Skyrus is climbing the ladder. He's gonna get it right now. This gonna be it. This gonna be over early. He's gonna come for you, Shogun. And now Kid pulls up. Oh, oh yeah, another oh. chop. The man's chest is gonna be bleeding by the end of this match. Two runners getting pulled out. Tyler Kid and Tash Mars looking together. Now wait a minute. The man Moran's back in the ring. Here we go. He's giving shots. Uh oh. Oh, big spot big buster. Rubber. Pandemonium here in this ring right now. I can't even keep up with all the action. Why did Johnny Ray take down the ladder? Reminiscent of oh. Terry Funk. Oh. 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 Call it, Brad. I know oh. you love it. <laughs> Somewhere in Amarillo, Texas, the Funker is having a good old time. He's rolling around his grave. And you're dead. I don't know, it seemed to be effective. He's the last man standing right now. Johnny Moran! Oh, so close to the number one there. Hunter. He can't figure the ladder out. Maybe he should ask the foreman, his tag team partner. Yeah. Foreman knows how the ladder works. I think. Well, you would think so, right? Well, he is the foreman. He doesn't actually do the work. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Cougar has a mass. Oh. Rams are right. Rams the, the man right into the ladder. Oh, oh. Rex with a big bicycle kick. Foreman's got the ladder. Wait a minute. Another oh. bicycle kick. Good gravy. Rex Taylor just took out the Ministry of Manliness with two bicycle kicks. The third bicycle kick Rex is unleashing on all the competitors right is now. Is Rex the dark horse of this match? I think so. I think he's very underrated. We didn't really see him compete tonight. Kind of snuck his way in there with Kit. They, you know, you would have to argue they might be the freshest men over Skyros. They didn't compete tonight. I, mean, I know that Moran and Kit Cash not look fresh at all. No, 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 no. They've taken a lot of punishment so far in this match. It's Rex's opportunity. He just has to get up and seize it. Shogun Machete still commentating without a headset. This is hilarious. <laughs> We're picking him up though when he talks. It's okay. Uh, unfortunately. He is the loudest champion that we've ever had. He's the only champion we've ever had. So by default, still the loudest. Unbelievable. Well, if he's Gorilla, that means I'm playing. This could be it. You could be facing the Foreman. Now, wait a minute. What's going on? Is the Foreman. Is, is the Cougar going to let the Foreman climb up the ladder and just grab it? He is his partner. Wait a, are they arguing? Wait a minute. He's pulling him down. Does he want it for himself? What is going on here? Uh oh, we have a little dissension between the Ministry of Manliness. This is gonna, this is gonna be the Knights. Uh oh. Wait a minute, we see some hurt feelings here. This is, this is the disadvantage of having a tag team partner in the every man for himself type of matchup. And the Cougar Hunter is just, is he letting the foreman go? He just pulled him down again. Uh-oh, just smacked him. Is he gonna climb up? No, oh. unbelievable, we're seeing it right before our eyes, the Ministry of Manliness just de decomposing. Already falling apart, these two. The most dominant tag team this country we've ever seen has already fallen apart. Unbelievable! What is happening right now? The number contender. Now they're stopping. Oh, top of the chest! Unbelievable! Tucker tried to cool things down a little bit, and the Cougar Hunter is not having any of that. Shots to the back. 
He just needs to get him out of the ring at this point. Everybody else is down. He needs to go and climb that title. Cyrus Mars making his way in the ring. Unbelievable. Now, wait a minute, Cyrus. Nobody is seeing Cyrus right now. I'm actually talking very, uh, very quietly. I don't want anybody to see. It. I think the kid has a shot. Cyrus is climbing. Nobody's even paying attention to Cyrus. I think he's got it. I think Cyrus has got it. He's up. He's got a hand on the briefcase. And all the Foreman chops him down, and he's really fighting it. I think the Foreman might be going for it. Scoops him up and just throws him down. Unbelievable wow. maneuver. That, that is was pure strength just lifting him off that ladder. That was orthodox to the least. Now, wait a minute. Oh, oh. We have some tension again between the middle. The Cougar Hunter seems, I think his feelings were hurt. He's a little upset. Jerome Wright, Johnny Miranda's huggy referee Pete. Tyrone Kidd enters, the student of the game, the student of the game. He's seen money in the bank matches before. He knows, he's watched his tape. He knows what's going on. Oh! Could this be Tyrone's chance? He's been here for years. Can he finally get a title shot? Nobody cares, Michelle. Tyrone Kidd, you know, coast to coast. <laughs> Joe goes, oh, wait a minute, screen bar! Oh! Tyrone Kidd, wow. the student of the game. He's got the gold right in his grasp. Can he climb up? Oh, he has up? to do it. Right up. He's got the momentum. Can he climb up and get the briefcase and challenge Shogun Machete for the belt? Unbelievable. This is the biggest night in the history of Backbreakers Training Center. Unbelievable. Oh, but un all that works. Tyrone Kidd is right there. Rex Taylor loving him. The Jurassic Jerk. What's he going for here? Electric chair, perhaps. No, wait a minute, can he grab it? Oh! Jesus. Drops him with that electric chair bomb. Unbelievable. Rex Taylor. I kind of I kind of lost my cool there for a little bit, but there's a lot of action going on, Brad. Going on I, I'm trying call. to keep up with this. Mike Skyros, back in here. Double axe handle. Oh, strong oh, East Crusher! Wait a minute. Oh, good gravy! Wait a minute. Tucker Riley. John with it! Unbelievable power. Wait a minute. Moran with the DDT. The ladder almost fell over. That's how forceful that DDT was from the man. Oh, good gravy! The ring went. Is he going for a cover? There's no cover. There's no pins here. No cover. Oh, Cyrus with the, with the nice sidekick right to the throat. This could be Cyrus's opportunity. Cyrus Mars. Cyrus is the only one in the ring. Climb the ladder. He's right there. He's got it. He's got it. I don't know what he's waiting for. He's going to the top. What you doing? The Tyrone Kidd sliding in behind him. I don't know what's going on. No, he's asking the crowd if he wants to go to the top rope. He didn't care what these fans thought in the last match. I don't understand what's going through this kid's mind. What's he going for? Son, run along out. Get out. Wait a minute. Right in front of us here, Brad. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's going on here? He's not doing it. Tyrone's behind him. Oh! He just pushed Cyrus Mars into all the competitors. Six minutes now inside the ring. TK may have this one wrapped up. Brad, I don't know. There's only two left. Who you got? Who you picking in this match? Who do you think? He goes to kid here, possibly. This, this is up in the air right now. All the six men are on the outside. Tyrone Kidd's the only one in the ring climbing up. Kidd's on the outside only underneath really the bottom rope. Tyrone Kidd is climbing with all of his might, but he's he's worn down. This is a tough match so far. Can he grab the briefcase? Can he take it home? Kidd's right behind him on the, oh! oh! Big club to the back. Just yanking him at the leg. Oh, low blow by Kid Cassidy. What a dirty maneuver, but it's legal. What do you call that one, Brad? Effective. Exactly. And Kid Kidd's Cassidy. climbing up. He's got the... Massive man right in front of us. He's got it in his oh, hands. Can he do it? Make history, kid. Make a name for yourself. Grab it down. Let's oh, go. Man. He's got it. And he has it. Kid Cassidy doesn't even wrestle tonight. Sneaks his way in to qualify for the match. And he is now the holder of the money in the bank for the Backbreakers Training Center. The question is now, Kid has all the answers. We're asking all the questions. He has a year. When's he gonna cash it in? 
Is he gonna cash it in? Who knows? I'll do it right now. Shogun Machete is for the hard fought match. Shogun Machete now has a target on his back the size of Wisconsin. Yes, he does. Speaking of Wisconsin, Kick Africa could take that briefcase, put all his clothes into it, and fly to Wisconsin. That's, That's a big briefcase. That's a big money contract. That's, That's what that is. 